Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, The Blood Samurai. My name is Sam and today we're back playing Destroy the Monolith. So the last time we played, I think I got absolutely decimated in one of the levels. I don't remember which one it was. Maybe it was this one. Maybe it was this one, I don't remember. Uh Ah, oh, that sucks. Well, this is the same same options. Okay, here's where I have my. We'll just go with this one, even though the last one is definitely better. Oh, I think I already. Oh yeah, this is the level that I got decimated on. Oh no. I should have gone for the other one. It's fine. Okay, I don't... I'm honestly, like, not sure what to do here. Like, I feel like I just need to try to take out the, um... the enemy things as fast as I can. it seems like they get harder and harder after each after each wave so yeah so if I can hurting a little bit. Okay, let's see. Bomber turret. We go for like the illusionist. 
and I don't know. I don't know, I think this will probably be fine for now. Once we destroy that one over here, then hopefully we can focus on the other ones. Uh, I'll just go for the Wheel of Fortune, why not? Okay. Now we can put one in another one of these down. So now we'll just have a bunch of these here. This thing is almost destroyed at this point. Pretty nice. Get out of here, dude. I just have to be very careful when doing this. Just because I could accidentally like carve out a path for them to take. And then they could just completely go around my defenses. Which is not what not at all what you want to happen. Healer. We could go for a healer. Um, so yeah, let's just destroy all of this. out like this area a bit. We'll set up the defenses. Okay, well, this is not really thoroughly thought out, okay.
Oh, and now I'm dead. <laughs> Please thank you for adding some docks for me to, uh, to move on. I appreciate it. Okay. Pretty big range. We're gonna need a bunch of these. to destroy this thing. Pretty nice. Let's see. This is an entire attack. Use the max health. Go with that. I should probably wait for them to be repaired and then destroy them. Cause then I'll get more resources back and stuff for for the repair or for the for destroying them. Do they repair the walls? They do, maybe. I'm not too sure. Kind of seems like they might. Do you guys repair the walls? Are you just not in range of the walls? Maybe they're, maybe they're not in the range of the wall? Were you guys not... Is it only wall... Maybe it's only walls that they won't prayer. Maybe not... If it's the healer that will repair force fields, that would be interesting. No? I don't understand. Why, why don't you guys repair the force field? I don't get it. Is 
the force field not a wall or something? Like, is it not considered a wall? I don't understand. You know, stay away from me. I carve out some of this area. so much more tanky now. Okay, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna cover the... <coughs> I'm gonna cover the area with the laser turrets. At least for now. Oh wait, I can just walk on the lead on the... Oh. I don't even need to put down the... Oh, okay. We are gonna just cover this area with these laser turrets. Just in the off chance that they do decide to try to uh, attack that this area. Okay, let's see. How far can this thing attack? This thing can attack like, like right there. So we want to carve out most of this area. So we could have a guy like right, like right there. Obviously, like force fields in front.
I'll also shoot two shells at once when I close range of the other. Uh, double when shield is up, and half when shield is overloaded. We're gonna reroll. <laughs> Ooh, keeps 10% of resources from the fish. Ooh. That seems really good. Interesting. Very interesting. Well, that's the one that I got like decimated on the last time. <clears throat> because of the reload duration of building actions. Because of, yeah, we'll go with like we'll go with that. Um Why do I keep holding shift? I don't know. That's a good question. far away can he shoot from? Right there? Okay. This guy right there, another one right there, and some more of these walls down. Isn't there three monoliths that I need to destroy? Where's the third one? There's two right here. Oh, there's the third one's right back there. Okay. So I actually have like the outer, like the, the back part, like back here, basically all to myself, which is really nice. We don't need to worry about them at all. You know what, I should have gotten that one technology that doubles my damage. Because I'm realizing like it probably would also double my damage against the ores. So that means like I can break them at like double the speed. Which would be super super nice. I should have gone for that technology. Should've. I really should have. It's fine. Cause it, it's like it uh, does double damage when you have um, when your shield is up, but then it's like half damage when the shield is overloaded. But at the same time, it's like it's 
still insanely good because how many, how often are you really gonna have your shield overloaded? Um. Yeah, maybe it decreases the cost of buildings. Yeah, we're gonna go with the loyalty card. That seems pretty good. Uh, clicks on the floor. Yeah, that's also pretty good. Uh, let's get this thing. Didn't really give me anything of too much value, but it's alright. Okay, and it's an enemy. I think I've pretty much gotten all the ores at this point. <laughs> I don't think there's really... Oh, okay. How did they get there? What happened? Oh, they just built this way. Okay. They just were like, okay, yeah, we're just gonna go around your defenses. Which, that's fine. I can just add more defenses on I just want to go around it, I'll just extend it. It's not a problem at all. keep trying to shoot at me and then they miss and they hit my defenses and that is not good. You're in range of that, right? Yeah. You're not in the greatest position though because you don't have a lot of defenses around you. Definitely something I should have taken into consideration put up before I put you there, but <clears throat> it's fine. It's really nice that, the, that they drop resources. It makes my life so much easier. Once I get rid of this one, then there's just going to be enemies coming from that monolith. And it'll, for the most part, be pretty much smooth sailing for me. I mean, I'm not too sure how useful the Tinkerer really is. Um, maybe what I could do is like do that and then put like the Tinkerer right there. The problem is, they still don't repair the walls, which I don't understand why. Like, repair the dang walls. Or the force field, I should say. Like, 
Like, I feel like repairing the force field is probably more important. But, whatever. How much health do they have? 5,000? Like, the force field has so much more health. And yet, they just, like, refuse to repair it. And it'd be so much better if you just repaired the force field, but whatever. Here's the reload duration. You can use the base attack damage. We'll go with that thing. So they'll attack, they'll start attacking faster. They also have more health. Yeah, I don't, I don't get it. Why don't you guys repair the force field? Maybe, maybe they only repair walls. Maybe that's the thing. Like, if I had walls there, then maybe they would repair that, but they don't repair force fields, I don't know. It just seems a little weird to me. Anyways, let's move this. Problem is now I have to move my defenses up to like right here. I mean, to be fair, if I have enough of these down, then even the laser turret shouldn't technically really get destroyed. Because <coughs> they'll just be repaired so fast that it won't matter, but... It's just annoying that I have to do that. I don't know if that reaches, but I'll just put some more repairs down. <coughs> just because I can. Oopsies. Yeah, I mean, they definitely deal a number of, da like, a good amount of damage against... ...against the turrets, but... Turrets are holding, sh holding strong. And 
surely they shouldn't have to survive for much longer. Oh my gosh. The only problem is they go around, but there's no turrets. It's so annoying, because then they destroy things one at a time. Job. No, one more relic. I'm choosing a new technology. Yeah, we'll go with that. Nice. <coughs> oh. Okay, now we have two more. Ah, oh, jeez. Okay. Well. Um. Wait, can I? How do I select it? Oh, excuse me. Alright, whatever. Um, anyways, I think that's going to be it for today's video. I wanted to get through, like, these two, and I'll probably do about, like, two missions per video, but... Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video of Destroy the Monoliths. Um, <coughs> sorry about that. Yeah, if you did enjoy the video, don't forget to like and subscribe. And uh, yeah, I will see you guys in the next video. Um, take care.